Okay, welcome everybody. This is my Dragoonity combo uh, tutorial. This is one of the most standard startup boards that you want to make with the Dragoonity archetype. Um, so let's get started. So this is a three card combo. And obviously this is searchable by many things. And a lot of these cards can be interchangeable, but you need the armor missile chain to have some kind of combo board. So by starting off, we'll activate the Dragon Ravine, use its effect, uh, discard the Phalanx for cost to search for a Dragoonity Dox. So we get the Dox, and then we'll use our normal summon to normal summon the Dox and equip the Phalanx using its on summon effect. Phalanx effect will now uh, activate to special summon itself to the field, and then we'll use the effect of Mistletane in hand to send Phalanx to grave and special summon Mistletane to the field. Uh, Missile Tain has a similar effect to Ducks, where it also equips Phalanx. Phalanx, again, effect, special summons itself to the field. So now we're going to want to use Ducks and Phalanx to synchro summon um, Dragoonity Knight Gaederg. Sorry, that's not Gaederg. Um, Gaederg. Now, uh, Gaederg effect will resolve. Uh, you can search your deck for a Winged Beast and then discard a Winged Beast. So you'll search for Baby Rock. And then discard baby rock. Baby rock effect when it's discarded, I can special summon it to the field. I'll put my graveyard right here at the bottom. So um, next, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to overlay your mistletane and Gaederg to make hieratic dragon of a tomb. Uh, a tomb's effect. You're going to detach Gaederg to special summon a dragon from your deck. So you're going to want to special summon red eyes darkness metal dragon. Uh, Red Eyes Effect, you're going to special summon the Gay Derg from the grave. You're going to resolve Gay Derg again to search your deck for a Zephyros and then discard the Zephyros. Uh, Zephyros Effect is going to return the Red Eyes to hand to special summon himself to the field by paying 400 life points, which doesn't really matter that much. And then we'll resolve uh, the effect of Red Eyes Darkness to banish a tomb and then special summon itself to the field. Uh, Red Eyes. Um, you have its effect again, you aren't going to use it yet because you're going to link the baby rock and the gay derg into your great fly, which requires two wins. Um, this is where the, like, the placement of great fly depends on what you, your hand is, whether you can make a bigger play, or you just want, want to uh, like have a standard play, so great fly. And then you can use Red Eye's effect again to special summon your Gay Derg from your grave. Gay Derg effect is going to resolve again. Search your second Baby Rock to discard it. Baby Rock will special summon itself to the field. And now you have options. You can link um, your Great Fly, your Zephyros, and your Red Eyes into a Link 4 Boro Load. And then you can continue from there. Or you can have your Red Eyes on the field and you can synchro for a crystal wing and if you're playing a link three which i'm not um you can link these into a link three so normally i would just go into a borolo dragon so now i have a good boss monster and a form of disruption on my side of the field so that's uh the first most standard board that you can make with the dragoonity archetype um if you don't really care too much about your crystal wing uh, let's rewind for a bit. We have a Great Fly, a Zephyros, and this on board. You can link these four into a Nightmare Griffin. And then basically your opponent can't activate special summon monster effects. So you don't have a dragon on board at the end of the turn, but you have... Um, your opponent can't activate any monster effects because they're not linked to anything because of Griffin. So this is... Like, this isn't an optimal board, but if you know that you're going to win against a matchup with Griffin, then you can make Griffin really easily in the deck. So yeah, that's just the first combo video, and I'll see you guys next time.